I take it again. And Luna, again, if you guys are just tuning in, the kid is nice. He's not, he doesn't come out very often, but when he does, he is so consistently good. And, you know, it's not surprising for many of us to see him here. Of course, he wasn't seated very high because, you know, you don't just see the guy high just because every time he shows up, you know, he does well. You see the people who are constantly coming out and winning high, right? But so Luna's, no reward for consistently yeah, attending. Yeah, but he's in the top three. Yeah. This is winners finals starting out on PS2 yet again, and I don't see us switching because this is what Luna likes the most. I like yeah. fair grab there. My my main uh, my main worry here for Luna is that Larry, a little bit more so than Charlie, is so good at the edge guards, like starting the double jumps. E even like with the mix-ups that Luna goes for, Larry plays very patiently on how Cloud likes to recover. Right. So what's the way that Luna is whiff punishing right now? Like the spacing is so perfect. Larry just is like just off the mark with so many of these hits. Like right there, he actually got sparks on that forward air. Luna tried to uh, cover it with the side view, but wasn't able to connect. Yeah, it always impresses me. Someone that can whip punish wolf ball characters. Right? <laughs> That's such good air mobility and hitboxes. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, whip punishing wolf is definitely hard. There's the forward throw. Oh. not going to connect when he gets the back air. And that's that's the thing, right? Is that like Cloud, once you like overcommit on that bear, if the wolf or anyone is in position to punish it, it's just so, so vulnerable. Yeah, that's uh, a lot of Clouds kind of just half assedly throw out that dare from ledge. It's for situations like that, but you know, if they're ready, you can just react to it. It's so much delay on the back there. Yeah, and so. it's all about your fade back, right? Like, how do you how do you drift after you throw that, uh, that down there out? Oh. All right. There's the parry on the forward air, and that's going to be like the only way that he gets that punish pretty much. The move is pretty much unpunishable if you don't parry it. Oh! F tilt! Another F tilt! Caught Luna yeah, using the limit, the too. limit and boosh. Dude, I wonder, Luna's got to be getting tired of these wolves just down airing him out of his up <laughs> when he's already dead. Luna's sick of this, dude. <laughs> like, I'm already dead, man. I'm ready for this bracket to be over. <laughs> get these wolves out of here. There's a whole pack of them. Very good drift to get out, but then gets sniped by the back air. Luna taking his first stock of this set. Oh, I'm surprised that tech, but oh. okay. Uh, Luna, Luna's falling apart a little yeah. bit. This game this over. This is this yes, game over. Yeah, he caught the jump. <laughs> Simple but effective, yeah. man. <laughs> That's are all you, gonna, you need. Are you gonna jump here? Of course you are. Yeah, and, it, and he's so far off stage. He doesn't pay anything for yeah. doing that, right? Like, he doesn't lose any stage position. He doesn't lose any ability to potentially two-frame or anything like that. Like, it's just so safe. So Luna just has to know that that laser's coming. Honestly, why didn't Charlie do that? Laser? Yeah. I think he did. Like, only once when he was, like, really far off yeah. stage and he didn't use his double jump. Yeah, Charlie likes to edge guard with Nair instead of laser. I think that's the difference. Charlie likes to hit people. Yeah. <laughs> I don't blame him, dude. Hitting people is fun. Charlie is like the interaction lord. Yeah. Oh, hold up. Down air? No way. Oh, you don't even need the down air. No way, oh, Larry, dude. Larry with no uh, emotional reaction to that. <laughs> I, I looked over to see what he did. Like, oh, well, that's why. Okay, never mind. Like, he had the limit. Good He charge. wiped his hand off, and then yeah. he was like, all right, let's go. <laughs> like, all right, you got it. Let's let's get back into it. Almost got you know that give from the uh, down tilt. Ooh, snipes, snipes. That's it. The, cog the the awareness, right? To just peek at your limit gauge, see that it's there. But Larry gonna take the stock anyways. He did get a little bit of percent for that though. Now Larry and Luna duking it out. Second stock each. Larry's starting to get in now. Oh, he missed his up air. Like might Luna, have been parried, though. I feel like Luna's trying to play. A, oh, wow, nice up yeah, shield. Yeah, he's just trying to play the pace that he's very comfortable in. Like, once he just starts getting a read on how these wolves like to jump in, so good with that up yeah, shield. Oh, oh, wow. all bad because you thought you're going to juggle me. That yeah. fastball up air is still. Key. You thought, you thought for sure. <laughs> thought. Nice. Great stuff from Luna looking good. Yeah, Luna took that last game and was like, okay. I need to make these adjustments, right? And the adjustments have been, how does Larry want to get in on me, right? He's been doing such a great job. Like, at the beginning of the first game, he was whip punishing really well, and then that kind of fell apart. Now he's whip punishing so well, and he's playing out of shield as well, and Larry's just not going for a lot of grabs. Like, when Larry does grab, he's getting it most of the time. So I'm surprised that Larry's not going for a couple more grabs. Yeah, I like how Luna's moving in the center of the stage, too. He's just standing there. Yeah. Like, what do you do as Larry? You just have to accept them. That was, I mean, oh, okay, he got nice. it anyways. He got it anyways. 
another. I love when he gets those jump call out limit cross slash. The one he got on Charlie was like so sick, especially on the last stock. Cause I don't know what it is. Like maybe he just knows everyone wants to jump in this game, especially like in you know I'm trying to stall limit or something. Or Jumping is busted, dude. Yeah. Jumping is insane. <laughs> For, frame three out of shield. Yeah. <laughs> you just get out of it. It's, it's I know like, light does that as well. Like he will uh, pressure your opponent's shield and then he'll preemptively do a jump up air. Yeah. He'll also like just like full hop back air. That might be the, the move, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> See these jumps coming. And it's, but the thing is, is like specifically for Wolf, because Wolf grounded, while is strong, like with F tilt and dash attack and whatnot, like lots of combo starters on the ground, right? It's strong, but it's not safe. That's the thing. And against Cloud, you have to act safe just because of that threat of up the outer shield. And so because he has to play so air-based, it's just opening up the world for Wolf. Mm -hmm. All right. Oh, I don't like that drift back to the ledge. Oh, man. At that point, he already uses the double jump. Just go to center stage. Yeah, you committed already, yeah. bro. Take a, take a hit to the center, because you probably won't die. Well, you have to think of... Okay, so I always try to like preach this, like, neutral and advantage, disadvantage, or like a spectrum. And in order to get from disadvantage to advantage, you have to go through the neutral. Or your opponent has to overcommit, and you can jump through it, right? And so... Luna tried to overcommit, but then said, ah, no, I'm going to go back. Yeah, and he yeah. was like kind of in between, and Larry just was able to punish mm -hmm. that. But he's going to get that stock off, even things up here. It's a no blade beam follow up, but there's the MPI shield. I don't think he got max damage on that, though. No. Unfortunately. But there's the F air to the dash attack. Love that new dash attack from Cobb, but oh no. Too crazy with that up being neutral. Oh, I'm surprised there was no F tilt there. He actually gets the wolf flash hitbox there. Sends Luna to the other side of the stage. There's gonna be an F tilt and one. not gonna take it just yet. The no, laser. The he, had, sniped the, he did a. Uh, he could have gotten Luna. I think he could have yeah, gotten that. Yeah, yeah. He, he gave up, I feel like. Yeah, he got. He was literally charging his uh, limit and then he got caught by the laser. He just fell to his death. There. Maybe he was scared of like finishing the dungeon in the battle from the last zone, but either way, he died. So really, at the end of the day, it didn't matter what he did. Oh, oh, you know the down one air more, is coming. One more. Oh, and he didn't have any time to charge limit. I'm so glad that Larry sees the the you know the usefulness of just going for the fair down air in that situation when he doesn't yeah. have limit. That's a that's actually a really interesting situation because assume that he has like a little bit more limit, right? Mm -hmm. That's where you know you do fair down air and then you get back and you charge the down smash like yeah. you tried to do and then you try to go for the two frame. But in that situation where it was a little bit less than full, I think it was actually optimal to just down air, down air. Mm. Because if Luna didn't decide to charge limit in the middle of his like double jump back up, I think if he just double jump up these immediately, he might have made it back. Mm, right. that. But again, poor Luna getting down air out of his up B <laughs> for the fourth time. Yeah, that's rough, man. Oh, oh the runoff up air is leading into so much. Larry. One, one game away. From We're seeing the playstyle change from Larry, right? Like, he's been playing very, very, like, horizontal combo base. Now starting to send Luna up in the air. There's a back throw. Looking for a punish. Oh, uh, yeah. Now, yeah, Luna's trying to get a little bit aggressive because he approaches another cross slash at the ledge. And that's that desperation cross slash. Yeah. Man. That's what I need to get I, out of Yeah, this I need thing. to get some percent. Need to, like, you know, get some type of momentum going. But there's the landing, getting caught by the up tilt. That's the scary thing so, about so trying fast. to yeah, trying to go around Wolf's back air is so scary because he has so many options in front of him after he throws out the back air, which has very little lag, that you can just get hit for it anyways. Oh, no tech on the platform. Oh. Charge down smash, lead into a back air. F tilt, yeah. not gonna check. Larry will take that trade with the down air all day. He does get the limit here, but I feel like yeah, Larry just waiting it out, you know. He but just be careful with his back air though. Because uh -huh. you know Luna's waiting for Larry to overcommit to try to take stage positioning, and that's what the back air is being placed for. Now Larry's got it, though, and this is hard for Luna to come back in. He managed to fight aggressively into him, though. Oh. Risky business out of shield here. No one wanted to throw the first punch. Yeah, Larry knows. Oh, okay, never mind. He dashed right into a forward air out. <laughs> Trust me. Yeah, Larry knows that he doesn't have to take any risk. He's just you know, throw Luna off stage, you probably get a decent edge guard. But there's the up the uh, shield again. Fortunately, not able to get that much follow-ups from it. Luna swinging out of disadvantage.
pretty often, but oh no! Bit. Oh, yeah. uh, he had that tech chase from the back air. He should have just tried to you know follow up from there. Well, that was the, that was the same mix up as earlier, right? He's gone for that read so many times at this point, where he just tried to catch your jump, and just does the short hop cross left, and Larry was ready for it that time. That's the scary thing about reusing mix-ups, right? Like sometimes they don't expect you to do it again because they think you're smarter than that. Right. But, but then, but then you use it again. They're ready for it. and You feel so dumb. <laughs> oh, a little bit off with the space of Larry, and that's just going to be enough wow, smash up. Luna managed guys, to look at this. <laughs> Casey forgot about that up smash buff. There it is. Yeah, man. Was that a hundred? Are on there? And Luna's managed to take this game and turn it back into his favor. 170, okay, falls out of the up B. Larry able to sneak that back air in. Yeah, a little bit unfortunate there for yeah. Luna. Now we're on last all the percent he could take. Because, you know, he doesn't want to start away from being sent to the lose bracket. But he definitely has the potential to bring this to a game five. So, oh, and it's not getting all the hits from the up B, oh, no. but there's a oh, double no. back air again. Oh, I don't believe That would have killed him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's for so sure. scary. For sure, it, Larry had no jump off stage. Okay. Uh oh. Oh man, he didn't land on the platform. Uh -oh. but we were swinging the back here all day. Take chase. Oh, too slow there. Oh, he doesn't get the grab. Because they're scrambling. Luna with an opportunity. Oh, oh, he might die for this. Okay, no, he goes straight to the ledge. I thought they would go for it in there. Oh my goodness, Luna just needs one interaction now. Oh, he didn't grab because crowd's grab is so slow. <laughs> Oh, he got punished for daring. Yeah, he just dared from like a little bit too much, but he did save his dojo and sweet spot the ledge. Larry oh, does not so want to overcommit. Look at the spacing. Oh, nice. That three percent in there. Oh my goodness, barely that was the scariest back thing. Here. Yeah. Luna, one hit from evening the score up, taking this to a game five. Oh, I'm just waiting for him to attack Larry's landing, oh. but who needs it? The sweet spot, fair Larry, falling asleep left the wheel a little bit there. He got caught with that. Oh, right? okay. So he, he no, won't can't dash out. Yeah, that's cancel shield. Yeah, he was trying to come into him, and I assume he was going to do like up air. Maybe he was going to go for dash attack. Dash attack might have no. killed that percent. So no. there were a couple things that might have worked out of that dash, but Luna shut it down. That Luna. Forward. Game five versus Larry. He's looking at Grands, man. He's got it in his sights. Man, what a story it would be. Luna, unranked, taking out. Larry and Charlie and winners, both of them top pulls in SoCal with new cloud. Come on, bro. Yeah. Can't make it up. I'm saying, man, Final Saga came early. <laughs> <laughs> this is the Final Saga warm up if Luna gets to win her side grand. The Final Saga pre local, man. <laughs> <laughs> Shout outs to all, all in National Arcadian, though. I mean, we, we did get Chili Chili out here. Yes, 500 raised for that, man. Yeah. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Alabama. I hope he's still in. We haven't been able to keep up with Bracket. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't had my phone. After oh. we lost the Charlie. But That's oh. big damage. Yeah, okay. Man, so, yeah, Luna in pretty firm control in this game five. Larry looking for a way in, but just continuing to take percent for just trying to interact. Wow, that reach? That wasn't even one out of shield. He's just like, okay, I know where you're going above me. Yeah. I'm just going to throw this That's at definitely you. reasonable. I, I mean, that's just everybody with an up out of shield, if you're just reasonably above them, sometimes they'll just go for it. Oh, yeah. my that's goodness. Did you forget? I love cross flash from the ledge. <gasps> oh! The placement. Did you see how he, 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 he wasn't he at the would, ledge? Yeah, he, he knew he would uh, go extend in. his, her, his uh, hitbox with the up B at that specific spot. Yeah, he wanted the like the, that sweet angle that would prevent him from getting dared at the ledge, right? Yeah. But Luna one step ahead dared oh, a little bit Oh, and he's inside. getting these hits. Double forward air into the dash attack. Oh, we're oh. taking away. That was a little bit different time for Larry to go for that down smash. Larry needs to up. recognize that he can't nair out a shield in the scramble. Like, every time he nairs out a shield in the scramble, he gets hit for it. Oh, free punish from Luna. So patient seeing that dash attack whip from Larry. Gets the blade beam out, and there's another up B out of shield. He's, oh, he's, oh, he's feeling the up he smash smells too. Blood, oh dude. yeah, yeah. He's trying to run away with this as much as he can, but the laser, <gasps> two. Oh, we'll take it all day. Larry throwing away his stock, trying to go for the easy mare, and now Luna one stock away from being a winner's side. Luna Grand has finals. turned a dial, dude. <laughs> he is moving, Ooh. grooving, dude, styling, wild. He just, he just ran up and grabbed with Cloud. With Cloud, <laughs> not supposed to be able to do oh, that. No. Oh no, he's yet to get touched. This man's trying to zero to death Larry on his last stop. <laughs> oh no, dude. Okay. Larry gets in finally. He wants like he wants like tech chase here. Wow, tech chase he went <laughs> down tilt down to back there. Okay. 
forces the limit. Oh, but Lunik puts him off stage with the second hit. Now he's got to get off of the ledge against Cloud. Oh my Cloud. goodness, this guy is oh so you're goodness. jumping above me, up me. All right. Larry, look yeah, at the so top player Luna right now. You see the pose. You see the you see the poise from him though, right? He's dialed in. He is ready to focus up and play. Larry takes that stock. Oh my goodness. Last stock. Larry trying to make sure he stays in the winner side of things. He's adapted. Dude, he adapted. He empty hops for the first time in a situation oh. where he would nair. <gasps> oh no way. Hey, not like that. <laughs> oh, what a way to go. He was so scared of all the options Larry was throwing at the ledge.